Hello? Is anyone there? I see you. Don't hide away. I know there are others. That's better. Did you know that 1 in 12 people in the world are infected with hepatitis B or C? You may have it even if you feel well. If you ignore hepatitis, it can destroy your liver and kill you. This is hepatitis. Know it, confront it. Hepatitis may affect anyone, anywhere. Hepatitis B. Hey, listen up. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, you think that there's no way you can catch Hepatitis B, right? Mm. Is that an <laughs> earring you have on your tongue? Did you know you can get infected with HBV while piercing your body? Oh, so now I have your attention. Piercing, tattoos, dirty needle. If it's not sterile, you get your nose out of that business. Oh, which reminds me, taking drugs through the nose can also lead to an infection with HPV. <laughs> yes, I am against drugs as well. But you should know that hepatitis B is transmitted through blood and other bodily fluids. It can happen while having sex, especially if you do not use a condom. You may also get infected during medical, manicurist or acupuncture procedures. Babies may get infected at birth if their mother has hepatitis B. As you understand, the virus is transmitted with unsterilized equipment. Okay, let me tell you about the symptoms of hepatitis B. If you have a new infection, this is called acute hepatitis B. You may get high temperature, loss of appetite. You may feel tired, have sore joints and muscles, heaviness in the liver, nausea and vomiting yellowing of the skin and whites of the eyes, the urine darkens. The most important thing is not everyone feels or shows <coughs> symptoms. Well, sorry, no, even if you have no symptoms, that doesn't mean you're fine. In some people, the infection becomes chronic and then it may last a lifetime. Many patients feel tired, but they don't have any clear symptoms. Even if you don't feel it, chronic hepatitis B can slowly destroy your liver. Calm down, listen, the immune system of many infected people can overcome the infection and hepatitis B goes away. If it doesn't, there is treatment. Though medicines cannot cure the chronic infection, they work to suppress the virus and stimulate your immune system. You can also help by keeping a healthy diet. Without fatty foods and alcohol, stay hydrated and rest. Coffee is also good for you, but no smoking. Most importantly, take your medicine as prescribed by your doctor. I won't lie to you, treatment of hepatitis B is no joke and it may last a lifetime. If you don't know that you are infected and you don't get treatment, hepatitis B can cause serious damage to your liver and even cause liver cancer. Come on, cheer up. Now you know how to protect yourself. If you are still healthy, the best way to protect yourself is to get vaccinated. And if you already have hepatitis B, treatment can still protect your liver from harm. If you are not already vaccinated, ask your doctor to tell you where you can get tested. He will also tell you where to get a vaccine. 